Hello everyone, my name is Brendan Snyder. Thank you so much for joining me and welcome to another episode of Let's Go to the Record Store. This time we're gonna head downtown Manhattan to a place called Downtown Music Gallery. And this place is really great. It's kind of like a little hole in the wall. You wouldn't expect it. You gotta actually go down into the basement just like the Ramones song. And there's this great sort of hole in the wall record store. And it's really cool. We're gonna go, as I said, downtown. We gotta hit uh, Chinatown, the Canal Street area of Manhattan. 13 Monroe Street is where it's located. But today is actually Chinese New Year. So when we go through Chinatown, we're gonna get to see some action, the celebration and everything that is Chinese New Year. I thought that'd make for a fun little trip here as we head down and you get the full experience of going to the record store. Let's head out and take a look. All right, hey everyone, so we made it here. We're outside Downtown Music Gallery. I know it doesn't look like a lot here, but inside it's really worth checking out. We gotta go down into the basement for this, and then you're gonna see a lot. Let's go take a look. Good, how are you?
All right, so we're back. Hopefully you enjoyed that trip to Downtown Music Gallery, Lower Manhattan, down in the Chinatown area at 13 Monroe Street. Cool store from what you can see. I mean, they got a little bit of everything in there. Uh, they've got, of course, records, CDs, cassettes, uh, videos. They've got just lots of stuff in different areas. Cool stuff to go through. Definitely check them out. So I got a couple cool things while I was there. I didn't really know what I was going to find today. And it was kind of cool. Uh, some of the guys that were working there were uh, seeing what I was going through. And um, I had first picked this up. This one here, Gentle Giant, uh, The Power and the Glory, 1974 album. Very cool. Don't know this one. Haven't listened to it. I picked up some Gentle Giant from them, Giant for a Day. Um, I think back around Thanksgiving or early uh, Christmas time and so good. I never really listened to them before. You guys then saw that I bought some more stuff going forward. Well, I went back and they had some other stuff. So I picked that up. One of the guys in the store saw me and so he comes over and he says, hey, do you have this album, Civilian from 1980? And no, this one is really hard to come by. So I was super excited that those guys helped me out seeing what I was into and came over and said, hey, you know, we've got another one of these. And what was cool is they were listening to it in the store and they were really digging it. So he was coming over to say, hey man, I really like this Gentle Giant album. Maybe you would too, kind of a thing. So 1980 album, this one is a reissue on One Way Records, but um, really cool, super excited to be checking this one out. And then another really cool find that I had I was pulling out these boxes that are under the CDs that are there and they're, you know, racks and digging through it and they're all dusty and whatever and people haven't gotten into them for a while. And then I found this, bang. So if you're not familiar with them, don't worry. They're a real underground sort of band. Uh, they're actually an American band, but it's really heavy hard rock. This is their second album. It's a self-titled album, uh, 1972. And just some really good, like, hard rock, underrated. This band has flown under the radar. They had a few albums out in the early 70s. Uh, broke up, disappeared, whatever. And then I think they reformed in, like, I don't know, 2014 or something. I was just kind of reading online that, oh, okay. So there's a version of the band that is back together. But their stuff is so hard to come by. I couldn't believe it when I saw this. Uh, a few years back, they had a reissue in a box set that is already out of print as well. So it was like, I've yet to come across any or be able to get any. And so to find this today, it was 10 bucks. Uh, totally worth it in my opinion. I was super excited. So I had some really cool finds, you know, between this album, Bang, The Gentle Giant, Civilian, which is again, very hard to come by. And then this one here was just cool to, to grab. Not so much hard to come by, but great. So. These are my three finds within this. You saw a lot of other great stuff in there. Hopefully that excited you. You can go out and search some of that stuff for yourself. And certainly if you are in the New York City, Manhattan area, lower Manhattan, definitely check out Downtown Music Gallery. It is totally worth it. All right, everyone. I hope you guys enjoyed this. And if you did, please remember to comment, like, and subscribe. Let me know your thoughts. Have a great day and go out and do some CD shopping. Bye, guys.